What's going on guys? It's your boy, Worthy Prince, coming at you with another Lords mobile video. And today, guys, I got a whole bunch of action for you. And we're gonna start off with ZG Guild, ZG Sunshine with 17.4 million troops. A really juicy target and a tier 5 target at that. Now the thing is, this target don't have much in the way of tier 4, but it does have a good amount of tier 2s. With a 2.3 million tier 2 gladiator front line, backing up with 5 million of reptilian riders and sharpshooters in the wrong gear though. I mean, this is like gathering gear and I think they're offline. We've tested the front line. It's going to be an infantry front. So we're going to need to start off with a real strong cavalry blast. And of course, that's going to come in the way of Florida boy from Flo. And then the other four rallies are going to be coming in with range blast. That's right. We've got five rallies here. So you can see myself loading up from TWK. We've got ZHR 305 from FES loading up with range as well. And uh, we've also got 1DB, Clownfish E7 coming in for 1DB, a new guild to the TWK family. And we also have B colon C uh, loading up as well. Um, so yeah, looking pretty good. Uh, hates Fury over the top there. You can see him in the Alcastle loading up too. Range as well. So. Florida should clear that infantry straight in with the range after. Now, guys, if you want to join the TWK family, like I said, we've got some new guilds coming into the play now. And the one I'm going to mention today is 1DB. If you're 400 million might plus and you want to come and join the TWK family, then hit up an R4 in 1DB to get over and have some fun with us because we're certainly having a lot of fun over in our kingdom right now and any other kingdom we go to from here onwards. So it'd be great to have you on board. So right now, we're continuing to load everyone up, making sure all the rallies are full. Of course, sending trip, sending players to different guilds if we need to, to make sure we're all full. Everyone's got their level 60 leaders. And if we time this right, it should be really nice. So far, I've seen no reinforcements going into that castle, which is a really good sign. We're doing it around the time that the Chinese guilds generally are asleep. It's like 2, 3 in the morning their time. Just checking my rally, looking good. A little bit less tier 5 than I would normally like, but that's okay. But I am full and I'm ready to go. And you know, when you're rally leading, just make sure you check this stuff. Make sure you check your timers are all under the rally time for it to go. Because you don't want to be sitting there waiting for a march to come in while, you, <laughs> while everybody else is marching on the target. So make sure you get everything set, ready to go. And I am ready to go right now with 10 seconds left. Florida's going to march first. I'm going to put my 50% attack boost on. There goes Florida boy with the calf. ZHR coming in behind him there. A little bit slow there. That's fine. And I'm going to go in with the range now. Here we go. Range gear on. Here comes Clownfish from 1DB on TWK. About to hit. Burning straight off the bat there. Oh my god. Florida boys hit. Burned him instantly with the first one. And then the range rallies all came in and absolutely decimated. Which is really, really good stuff. So yeah, nice. Really nice uh, zero there actually. From basically from 17 million troops down to zero with the five rallies. Maybe a slight bit of overkill with the five. I don't think we possibly needed five. We could have done it with four, I reckon, looking at the battle reports, which we're going to go and take a look at right now, okay? Down to 330 million might. Just check and see if there's any resources or troops left. And no, it's completely gone. <laughs> really good stuff. Nice zero. So let's jump to the battle reports. And you'll see straight off the way here, the Florida boy came in with a massive 5 million red deads on that first hit. That's the infantry and some on that first hit. 12 million left. You can see coming in now, 1DB, Clownfish taking him for 4.7 on that second hit. Very nice indeed. Uh, coming in with my rally next in third here with a 4.9 million red thirds. Oof. Really, really, really good hit from what yours truly. <laughs> and then we've got FES coming in, hitting 2.4 million troops, taking out 1.9 of those troops. Potentially, they went cavalry as well now. I'm thinking about it in hindsight. Maybe they went into some range, possibly. But 2.4 million troops. And then we've got 529,000 from BC. Wish they hit a bit more. But unfortunately, on this occasion, they got the leader and the last bit. So overall, a really good job from the fam. Coming out in force, taking out one of these ZG targets. 17 million troops, zero. That's a good way to start the video, right? And everyone's happy about that. Chucking up those awesome emojis. <laughs> All right, guys. Moving on to some more action now. Check this out. We've got Domino from Flo. This is my solo trap, guys. Check this out. I've got a march coming in. The gear's looking better, right? <laughs> so you can see the march coming. I did do a very quick gear swap. Wasn't needed, though, because this march was fake. It was a little test march. 
to see what's going on in my castle. But after a while, they did come over and set a rally, which was interesting. And then Florida set a rally on the person who set a rally on me, and they cancelled. The next thing I know is I've got Wooming888 porting in with some pretty serious gear. He's in infantry gear right now. And I'm like, okay. Alright, buddy, I see you. <laughs> I'm watching him because I'm thinking maybe they're going to try and attack me with like a group attack or something. I check Wooming's gear again. He switched to range. I'm like, hang on a sec. Is this guy... Is this guy gonna solo me? Estrella, Estrella's still in cav, but Wooming is the one I'm looking at. I'm thinking this guy looks a bit aggressive, coming in with the infantry gear, switching to the range. He's doing something, and I don't like it. Here he comes. I'm in infantry foul, luckily enough. I go and switch my gear. I don't think I quite get it on in time, because he hit so fast. Level 3 boots on me there. But I did cap the leader. Check it out. Solo trap in action, baby. <laughs> Captured his leader. Very nice. I don't think I got the gear on because I took a bit more damage than I would normally take getting the counter on him. But 408,000 wounded. I don't mind. That's fine. And 150,000 red deads for him. So that was a tier 5, tier 4 march as well, guys. So really nice take on the solo trap. And uh, yeah, really, really happy about that. Again, I don't think I got my gear on in time. And of course, if they did group hit... Then I would be in, you know, in gear, I'd be in the, in the infirms, insta-healing and stuff. That's the gear he hit me with. It's pretty solid range gear, to be honest. He's got to be pushing about 800 with that. So very, very nice indeed. Okay, got another target. Check this out. This is from KVK this weekend just gone. This guy here is 453 million might. All right, he's just chilling there in his gold monster gear. And I'm like, okay. I don't know whether I should rally him or not, but I'm thinking, there he's tiles. He's going to be online. Let's just pull over. And see what's going on with these tiles. So I go ahead and attack his first tile to see if he pulls it back. Right? He doesn't. Okay. <laughs> he doesn't pull it back. And I check. He's in cavalry wedge. He's in cavalry wedge. Okay. So now I'm going to hit the second tile. And see if he changes his phalanx again. Alright? Because I, I, I just want to see if he changes it. I go hit the second tile. He doesn't pull his tile away. Alright. It dropped him a little bit of might on that, that hit as well. He had more troops in there. Look. 206,000. I gave him 116,000 red deads with that hit. He's still in cavalry wedge. But he is 456 million might. So, I mean, he's going to have troops in there. Uh, I don't know. You see someone else putting in as well there. I think Penny's just putting in with me. There she is. I decide, guys. Guys. <laughs> I decide to YOLO it. And I decide to try and solo this 456 million might guy. Oh yeah, your boy is going in. I'm putting a 50% attack boost on. I'm going to go range. He's in Cav Wedge. I think he's probably expecting me to set a rally. I take out the tier 5 Siege because I want to go a bit faster. And it's time, guys, to solo it. You ready? By the power of Grey Skull. By the power of Grey Skull, indeed. I am going in. Let's get it. <laughs> I burned this guy for 1.9 m -m -m million troops. Cavalry Wedge, eat that. 31 million might drop on the solo. What? What? Look at his troops. He had tier 4, tier 2. I mean, you have to pause it to see that. But he had a shit ton of troops in there for a solo march. All that tier 4. He bubbles instantly. Oh my god. <laughs> what a solo blast that was. And then check this out. This is anybody's KVK dream. Check this out. I put in on this target. I'm like, right, I'm going to set a rally on you, bruv. Okay, rally is set. I set the rally. And he gets a fresh fury. <laughs> Look at this. He wasn't looking at what was going on. I put next to him. I set the rally just as he goes and gets a fresh fury. Now, the funny thing is, Flo have already got a rally on this guy. Look at Lords going past the screen now. Look, Flo have got a rally on him. Why is this guy getting fresh fury when Flo got a rally on him? What is he doing? He must be empty. So I go and hit him with a leaderless tier 2 march to see if he burns. He doesn't. Which means he must have troops inside. So I'm like, okay, let me just go heal these quickly. And then I'm going to hit you with a tier 2, tier 4 to see if I burn you. Because how can someone be so ignorant to being rallied by sitting there getting fury? Unless there's some kind of massive rally trap that don't care. I don't know. I mean, you would be doing everything you can to try and keep yourself safe. Not try to get into fresh fury. I mean, I, I don't know how that works. Maybe he hasn't noticed he's got a rally on him. I ain't got a clue. Here comes a tier 2, tier 4 march. So this is my tier 2, tier 4 infantry. He ported on that. 
So he took that one. Okay. So I hit him with that. It didn't burn him and dropped him a tiny bit of might. So this guy's got troops. That's the bottom line. He took a tier 2, tier 4 leaderless. He took the tier 2 leaderless really well. He didn't burn at all. Didn't lose much might. So I'm quite happy to continue with the rally. And furthermore, I'm quite happy to go ahead and carpet this really fast when it's ready to go. Um, his guild's called Aikida Panic Attack. Dude, it's time to have a panic attack. You're in trouble, bro. You're in big trouble. <laughs> okay, so we've got MST99. He's sitting there chilling. I'm getting myself ready for a range blast. So ranged talents on, speed gear on for the moment. We put ourselves in the infantry wedge. I think I went for an infantry wedge, yeah. Infantry wedge, cav wedge, they both work really well. I think infantry wedge can be a little bit better sometimes for your range blast, but it's kind of self, you know, what you prefer, you know. Checking my rally again, guys, making sure you check your rally, check your troops, make sure everyone's sent the right troops, that all the timers are coming in correctly. Those arrows there is not a scout. I think that might be a rally coming in. Okay, I'm telling the guys in the chat, to go ahead and make sure they give me some mega carpets guys mega carpets let's smash him we want to get a good bunch of kills here i'm going to jump out the chat now and i think whatever's hit him is about to hit no no here comes the rally boom <laughs> flow hit him and do some pretty insane damage i mean 3.1 million killed ninja troops 71 million might drop i'm on the call with them they tell me he's still got 5.4 million troops go 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 i'm like okay i've got 10 seconds and we are going to carpet this super fast. He doesn't want to be near the scout. Let's get away from the scout. Okay. Three, two, one. Let's put the range gear on, baby. And off we go with the gold champion chest plate. He does. He saves us the carpets. He pulls. Thank you so much for the three m -m -m million kills. Hell yeah. I'll take that in cavalry phalanx any day of the week. Although I think a lot of his cavs already killed. I was really enjoying that hit. And look at the arrows from Fez. Fez came over and set a rally as well. He ported on Fez's rally straight after my rally. And you can see the arrows coming down from Fez's castles. That's because they also got the cleanup hit of 1.7 million and captured his leader. A bad day at the office for NST99. <laughs> anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll catch you in the next one. Stay safe, everybody. And of course... Peace out.